Hello, welcome back to Nails by Sora. I hope you are doing well. We're getting a start on the holiday season. I know we've been well into it so far, but now we're going to be really diving deep. Um, so I'm going to do a video on putting away all of my gems and rhinestones and glitter um, that I received in my Black Friday haul. So I've got two kits here from um, uh, Lizette Gel Nails. They're Bling It boxes. This one is, um, I keep forgetting, I threw away the receipt. Um, for lack of the actual terms, it's purple and pink. And then we've got um, a sapphire and I forgot what this one is called. Um, you would think Ruby, but no, she named it something else. Um, I'm actually going to tack this on to another video I already made because I received, um, I bought one of her other Bling It boxes, which is uh, champagne and emerald. Uh, so I've already recorded that video. I'm going to tack it on to this one. Um, and then I've also got all of my charms from Daily Charm that I want to organize and put away. So we're going to get into that. I hope I have enough room in my um, gem case which is admittedly quite on the small side. So I got this off of Amazon and I have a paper towel on top of it because it, um, unfortunately, it doesn't, um, the lid doesn't touch all the way down to the dividers. So the gems have been sliding back and forth and I've already had to reorganize it twice. Don't wanna have to do it for a third time. So, um, we're going to do a little bit of an ASMR style video of me just putting everything away. So I'm going to put on the music and I hope you enjoy.
Well, hello everyone. Welcome back to Nails by Sora. I hope you're all doing well. Uh, today I've got another mini haul. Um, I'm not going to be doing a manicure today. I just wanted to go through what I got from Lizette's uh, gel nails. Uh, Lizette, I have followed her on YouTube for a while now and she has her own line of gels and gems and other products. I'll link her information down below. Um, but I put off purchasing any of her products because, well, specifically any of her gems because I'm not one to really wear gems on my own nails. But the more and more I get into the world of nail art, the more I branch out, the more, um, the more intrigued I am by them and the more I would like to play with them on my own nails. Now, unfortunately, because um, I'm still in the culinary industry right now, I can't really wear anything too ostentatious on my nails in terms of products that can potentially come off um, if they're improperly, improperly set or cured, which um, I haven't really had any problems in the past a few times that I have done nail gems. I've only had one pop off, but I can't risk it coming off in the food. I don't really want to waste the products on uh, nail sets that I'm not going to wear, but now that I'm actually getting into the professional nail industry and I hope to take clients at some point, I'm assuming that they will want gems and um, other 3D items on their nails. So I would like to practice with them. So she has these bling boxes, which I'm going to unwrap in a moment. But one of the things that I did think that I could potentially wear on my own nails are the cuticle bars. And she uses them all the time and she has a few selections in different finishes. Um, she's got the rose gold, she's got silver, and then she's also got um, yellow gold. So I'm not very much a yellow gold person, but I figured it would be good to have <laughs> um, but I might play around in the coming weeks with the um, with the silver and the rose gold, especially as we get into the holidays. I thought they might be fun to uh, be my first foray into nail jewelry on my own nails. So I'm going to set this aside for now because I want to get into the bling box. And she has a few different ones on her site. Actually, she has, she has quite a few. Um, but the one that I really wanted was the emerald and, um, emerald and, emerald and, uh, champagne gold. I couldn't remember if it was a rose gold or a champagne gold. So I like her bling boxes first and foremost because they come in a box. I don't have to worry about, you know, separating things out and putting them away. They already come already organized. And they are in individual baggies, which is good because that means that in transit, they won't get knocked all the way around. So I'm just going to take this moment to go and empty them all out. Have you ever seen anything so beautiful as well-organized jewels and gems and bling? I am so in love and so excited to do some jazzed up manicures. Unfortunately, I don't have anything to put these away in right now, so they'll stay in their sleeves. Um, I'll probably get another case like this um, to organize them, but for now they'll still stay in my daily, uh, charm sachet, and that's going to do it for this video. 
Thank you all for joining me. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to see more videos like this, please let me know down in the comment section below. Um, links to all of these products will be in the description box below. And I will see you in the next video. Thank you so much for joining me. Please hit that like and subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you always know when new videos are available. And I will see you all soon.